everybody. We hope you guys like the show and uh, seeing the update of what we've got going on here at SJC. Um, lots has changed, as you can see. Um, a lot of really great new initiatives and uh, things that we've been putting in place here uh, since we teamed up with Marcus last year. So it's been a crazy year, and uh, 2016 is uh, you know nothing different. We're trudging along and uh, doing a lot of really great new things. So I just wanted to show you a quick update. Um, at the shop, kind of show you a little bit more in depth than what you saw on the show um, of what we get going on here and uh, introduce you to all of our new people. So, Marcus's People Process product, that's what we've been working on all last year and it's been, uh, it's been great. So, quick tour of the shop. We got all new shelf, uh, shelves for uh, racking for our drum shells. Way more organized so everybody knows where everything is. Get the signs, shell inventory. Um, this area looks a lot different than uh, when you saw on the show. So, look at all that inventory. It is insane. Before we met up with Marcus, uh, and one of the main reasons that I reached out to him was we needed inventory. You know, among, among all the other issues that we had as a company, um, inventory was up there on the list and we were always running out, um, never able to keep things in stock. Um, so Marcus has really helped us uh, ramp up our inventory so much so that we needed to take a whole entire spot of our shop uh, to to uh, do it. That's James. Hey. Say hi. James yep. came on as uh, inventory purchasing and making sure that all this is kept in, in track and uh, that we got everything. Oh yeah. What's up guys? What's your name? Zach. How's it going? Yeah. What do you do here, man? Good. Uh, I'm picking parts right now, but I just cut these shells for the new uh, profit kit and um, then we're gonna move down to woodworking. Awesome, awesome. Zach moved down to Massachusetts from New Hampshire. So that's awesome. We've got a, we've got a lot of new people on our team which we're really excited about. And uh, he mentioned the profit kit. So tonight on our website, uh, you can purchase uh, the American Dream Kit. We wanted to make a drum set that um, kind of went along with the show. You know, Marcus and the profit, um, it's all about you know, making the American dream possible. And that's uh, really awesome for us because obviously we're an American company. Um, you know, Scott, my brother and I started this company many years ago and, uh, you know, didn't know it then, but we were chasing the American dream. So we built this drum set, um, all the guys here collabed and we did a red, white and blue drum set, uh, you know, American dream. So you can check that drum set out on our website, sjcdrums.com, it's for sale. Uh, if you purchase it, the proceeds are going to a charity, which will be listed in the uh, description of the product. So, um, yeah, here's all of our new inventory. We got everything that we need. We got hoops, heads, uh, hanging mounts. We've got our own thrones now, which is on here. We've got practice pads, a bunch of new product and stuff. We've got practice pads, which are really cool. You can pick those up on our website. Um, stick bags. We got new badges with our new logo, which was one of the things we couldn't do just because uh, of finances. So we got wood, we got brass, we got chrome. This is our old badge, which cost uh, three times as much, which is crazy. Um, we've got tension rods, we're organized. We've got all of our brass hoops, you got black hoops, you got chrome hoops, you got floor tom legs, you got brackets. We got our own bracket now with our logo inscribed into it. And then where are our lugs? We've got our own lug now, which we are really proud of. So we didn't have this when the show aired originally. It was one initiative that Chris and I and the guys were trying to get going, but that's our new lug. So it matches our logo. Uh, so branding is consistent and it sets us apart. It's awesome. Looks really good. So yeah, that is that. We've got the cart system in place. So all these orders ready to go out. We've got backline drums that we're making. We've got uh, yeah, a lot of different stuff. So let's go introduce you to the other guys and see what everybody else is working on. Zach's pulling parts. What else? So the process has changed a lot uh, from the show as well. This uh, became prep and sanding. And that's Louie down there working on some hoops. Sanding in here. We got a bunch of new equipment as you saw on uh, I think it was on the first episode, but we got a new, uh, some downdraft tables, some buffers, some uh, new paint equipment up in our paint booth. These are all orders that we're working on right now. So we got a club order for a customer. We've got a guy named Adelstein Olufsen. Sorry, dude, don't know how to say your name. Bunch of orders in process. 
Louis on here with a uh, new sanding uh, tool that he just built. Pretty sweet. Don't want to disturb him too much. And then uh, we got Matt down here. You guys remember Matt? Got a new powder coating booth. And then I don't know if Josh is up here. Yep, Josh is up here. Josh is wrapping some drums. That's Joel. Joel, what's up? What do you do here, man? I'm learning how to rap right now. It's my rap protege. My mentor. Cool. Awesome. Passing the torch. So we're growing, huh? New people. Growing. What's going on? We're getting huge. You know, <laughs> that's all. Taking over the drum world. Trying, we're, right? Uh, we're trying. We're trying our best. We got to uh, increase production to keep all the kids happy and keep the drums flowing, you know? We're trying to get them out quicker, too. What was it like before Markets and the Profit? Uh, it was fun. It was interesting. <laughs> It was a lot more rambunctious and less organized. We've become a lot more streamlined these days, trying to get some of these crazy custom ones out a lot quicker for everybody. Yeah, right, new turnaround time. Adore, yeah, getting that new turnaround time down. Yeah. Always trying to knock the turnaround time down. That's goal number one. You know? Yeah, when we met Marcus, the turnaround time was what? Eight or nine months? At least. At least, and now it's eight weeks. So we're really proud of that. So um, what else? More efficient tools. More efficient, new tools, new shop layout, trying to keep the flow going. Just uh, growing in every way possible. Awesome, good. And I didn't cry this episode, so that's good. We well, haven't seen it yet. You I don't know. think I cried anyway. I don't remember crying. All right, see you guys. See ya. What else, what else? We got, uh, we got some changes that we made to the product mix. We came out with a good, hi Matt. Hi. <laughs> We, uh, we came out with a good and better kit on our on our website right after the episode aired and we got a lot of feedback from you guys on that and we took it into consideration and we turned the good kit into the club kit which is a nice little bebop uh, kind of jazz kit. Uh, I think you can see it somewhere in here, no? Probably already shipped out. Anyway, it's a 10, uh, six, uh, 14 and a 20 inch kick drum. And, or an 18 inch kick drum and it's uh, awesome. It's got a banana rail mount, sounds amazing. The rack tom is, is huge. So that's called the club kit where, you know, showing you that you can use it in a club, you can use it at a gig, you can use it at home, you can even use it in a studio. Um, and then the better kit turned into the tour series kit. So that kit is more geared to, towards, you know, obviously anybody can play it, but more towards the touring musician. Bigger sizes, 12, 16, 18 and 10 add-on and an 18 by 22 inch kick drum. Uh, the only thing that we changed on that is from a flat black wrap, we changed it to a black satin stain and it's got a new lug on it. So that's that. Here's a beautiful kit. What's up, Pat? What's up, guys? How you doing? What you working on, dog? Putting the finishing touches on a huge kit for our man, John Hill. No, John Young, right? John Young, John Young. <laughs> John Hill, you John order Hill. so much from us yeah. that we're getting every, every other John mistaken. <laughs> Really nice though, all birch shells, high gloss purple finish. Nice. Woo. How has our process improved and everything? Like this this finish for instance, how how has it differed after we teamed up with Marcus and the Prophet? Well, it used to take us a lot longer and stuff was going all over the place. And now that Marcus came, cleaned it up, uh, we get done a lot faster, more precise, and it gets to you guys better than ever. Awesome. That's for sure. What about product mix? You guys have been working on a lot of garage band snares, huh? Oh yeah, a lot of snares coming through, hit the website up. Um, lots of in-stock drums. Uh, we're just putting those together so fast, so precisely that it's getting stocked up. So go buy some. Awesome. You got a Michael Jackson glove on there. What's up with that? <laughs> yeah, you know, it's part of the new quality um, initiative. We want everything to be a lot more clean. You know, we have a big name and we want to hold our expectations up to that name. So awesome. clean, mean, ready to go. Awesome, dude. Awesome. Oh, yeah. Uh, we got Ricky, he's not here today, but uh, yeah. There's our new, I don't know why that's up there, but our, uh, our manufacturing schedule is up there, so it changed from over there to over here. Got Josh in office in here. Josh has stepped up insane amounts, uh, so he's our team leader in manufacturing, so this is his office. We got our mission statement, our vision statement, our values, you know, focusing on the culture of the company. Um, we got a quality check area, so this uh, room they're working on getting some nice lighting with uh, swivel tables tables that they'll be able to check everything for quality. You got a granite slab there, make sure that's all good. And then we got this thing, we got a big CNC machine. So this uh, drills all of our shells for us. I don't even know, I'm not even supposed to be near it, so Chris and Marcus, I'm sorry, but 
I'm buying this machine. I don't know what any of this stuff does, but it's pretty sick. Chris is a genius and made all this stuff, and Matt is also a genius for knowing how to punch these buttons and make it happen, but it drills all of our shells for us. So way more efficient, way more accurate. Um, means that your drums sound better, stay in tune way longer and better, um, and just everything's so much more accurate and efficient, which is awesome, which is how we're getting that turn on time down. Um, there's a cool kick drum. We've got a new camera that we started to use on this uh, wall over here, so we're gonna do audio files for all of our drums, all the in-stock snares and all the uh, series kits and snares. You'll see an audio file uh, coming up. We got a lot of questions on how, you know, the drum looks great, but how does it sound? So now you guys will be able to hear how everything sounds on our website, which is awesome. Doing some inventory. Gotta keep it in line. Keeping it in line. We've got new shipping area back here. So James also does shipping. What else do you do? I do uh, purchasing. I handle all the inventory, shipping, making sure uh, all the stuff runs smoothly. Nice. And I'm sure you've heard horror stories before before you came on and when Marcus made that possibility, right? Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> still cleaning up some of the mess? Yeah, still cleaning it up, but we're getting close to it. We've got our lead time down to almost eight weeks right now, so it's come a long way. It is, it is. Awesome. No. What's new with you, Chris? Not much. Just finishing up the BKD. Nice. You know? Virtual so kit design. Hopefully that'll be out in a couple months. Nice. It's, uh, it's looking really nice, so I awesome. hope you guys like it. Hell yeah. What, what is your favorite thing about After the Profit? Inventory. Uh, having inventory to build drums and not having to worry about where we're going to get all of that. Um, and seeing a lot of drums go out the door. So, you know, going from having 30 drums, if that, go out the door in a week to like 60 is crazy to see. It's awesome. And no past due orders. Woohoo! No past due orders. <laughs> Before Marcus came on, Oh my God, Chris and I- 80 past due orders. 80, and we're not proud of that, and, and we're laughing because we're, we're past that, but that was the worst. Yeah, definitely the worst, and like, we felt it every day. I know our customers were frustrated, but we were also frustrated, so it's yeah. way better now. So yeah, we're on our way, we're killing it. You guys rule, thanks for the support. Hi, Matt. Hi. <laughs> this doesn't look like it's gotten any easier. Um, no, this is one of the dirty jobs from SJC. <laughs> what do you like? What's what's new in your area? What's going on with you? Um, I like that my powder coating booth, I don't have to breathe anything in anymore. It all gets sucked away from me. Good. And um, the granite tables make doing edges a hell of a lot easier. Awesome. How about the CNC machine? That thing's insane. It's a beast. Um, the CNC machine is a monster and it is very difficult to, to tame. <laughs> But it makes it way more efficient and accurate, right? Everything is 100% in line, no no having to open holes up or do anything. Everything is perfect from the machine, on the money, 100%. Awesome. Any message for Marcus? Thank you. <laughs> that was good. Yeah. <laughs> nothing but love, nothing but love. What about you, Josh? Me message for Marcus? Marcus? Thank you. Thank you for the help. <laughs> Hell yeah. All right, you guys. We'll and see you later. What? Where's our shoes? Where's our shoes? We want some free sneakers. <laughs> we need some shop kicks. Hey man, nothing's free, right? Nothing's free. Oh, what's up? <laughs> Probably an interesting time, but how can I help you? <laughs> hey, I'm what Zach. You, what do you do here? I am kind of a customer facing sales guy. So all the sales right now come through me. And whoever calls, hit me up, try to build sets and kits and snares and I'm kind of doing, doing a lot right now, and I'm eating a salad from Subway. The chicken chop salad, to be specific, <laughs> and it came to $10.59 for all. That was a good bargain. <laughs> but, is there anything else I can use for you? It's all. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How do you like working at SJC so far? Oh, uh, honestly, oh, I have stuff in my teeth. It's like, <laughs> let's see, let's see. <laughs> I'm just but, joking. No, honestly, it's like, a, it is a dream come true. I told myself way back when, I was like, one day I'll work at SJC, and now I'm here in my goofy sweater and my beanie crushing deals so Heck yeah. if you need a kit need a snare just hit me up i'll answer the phone and we'll build something together what's your email zach z-a-c-h a lot of people write k still some people here zach at sjcdrums.com excellent yeah. what what's what's coming up for sjc what's some of the cool stuff we're working on with marcus's team and things to make e uh, purchasing drums easier funner more affordable 
Yep. So, well, we're going to have a lot more people. We're going to have Zoe. <laughs> Actually, um, she's going to, you know, help build the kits with us. No, but, you know, eight weeks turnaround time. We want to get your order in. We want to get it out the door to you as fast as possible. You know, I'm sure you've all seen our new lug, which is really cool. A lot of people getting that on their kits, which is nice to see. And, you know, just every, the process is going to be a lot smoother, which is good. It's, you know, that's why I'm here helping you know people find us and get the drums out the door a lot quicker and more efficiently so awesome a lot of good stuff country right so right now i'm well i'm doing all the country but we're going to have so i'll be east coast and then we'll have you know central us and then west coast we're going to have teams of brand ambassadors on the ground going to meet drummers at shows so look out for people maybe with sjc swag talk to them they'll probably come up to you and we want as many people to join the sjc family as, as possible because you know Another person behind our kids just makes us happy, makes them happy, and just this a big, big happy family is what it feels like so far. So, you know, people still reach out and just be like, I don't even have a kid, but I love you guys. So if we can keep creating that, I think we're good. <laughs> we cleaned our showroom. It was really messy before, so we got a nice new showroom. It looks 10 times bigger than it, than it was before, which is awesome. Got the kit that Jay Weinberg was using still chrome kit we got all these snares we got ricky in here ricky what are you working on what is uh what do you do here uh customer service and soon to be social media do you like it i love it awesome I love servicing the customer <laughs> what's your favorite part about doing that uh when we can make you happy <laughs> my job is to make you happy and you're like you're the man behind the snapchat huh i'm the man behind the snapchat awesome so. Snap away. Snap away. Snap if away. you guys want to see anything crazy that we don't blast about, request, I don't know how Snapchat works, but. <laughs> Follow us on Snapchat, snap me anything, and let me know what you want to see. All right, and he'll make it happen. Yeah. Sick. Sick. What What do you think? You've been with SJC for a while now. Many years. Like, four, almost four. Yeah. What's what, What's some of the big changes that's happened uh, since teaming up with Marcus? Uh, our process is definitely better. <laughs> <laughs> um, the shop's a lot cleaner kind of know where to go to get what you need to get. People are happier. People are definitely happier. Cool. All right, man. Thanks. Bye. And who's this? Hi. 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 What do you do here? I make art sometimes. Sometimes. That looks cool. Thanks. That looks like a blast for our episode on The Prophet. Yes. When did you start? 20 minutes ago. <laughs> Maybe. How do you like it so far? It's going well for 20 minutes in. Good. Okay, good. Yeah. Are you a drummer? Okay, that's all right. That's not one of the prerequisites to work here, but there's always not a drummer in there. So. She's totally a drummer, I look at her. <laughs> no. All right, cool, well thanks. thanks. Good to have you. Thank you. <laughs> See you guys, I'll leave you alone now. Bye. You're gonna go do some I'm customer service-y things? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna follow you. Okay. No, I'm just kidding, I'm gonna stop now. Bye. <laughs> and uh, that's about it, that's, that's the shop. You know, it's, uh, we're crammed, but it's uh, super clean and efficient. So we're uh, everybody here is having fun and uh, living the dream. So again, thank you guys for checking out the episode. Thanks for supporting us. Thank you, Marcus and the whole uh, Marcus Lamonas team. You guys rule. Tom, Dan, Natalia, um, Seth, Erica, all you guys, you all rule. Um, yeah, anything else that you guys want to see, please comment below. Let us know. We're always here. Any of us here are here to, are available to answer any of your questions. Um, we're going to start doing some maybe uh, live Q&As that you guys can talk to the guys in the shop, get, get tips on how to tune your drums, um, you know, keep them maintained uh, properly. And that's basically it. So again, thank you so much for the support. Hope you enjoyed the video. Sorry it was so long. Uh, we'll see you guys soon. Later.